Hey guys, welcome to another video. Today we're going to be showing off one of the brand new codes in Build a Boat for Treasure. This code is one of the most OP codes in Build a Boats. If you were following the creators in their Discord, you know that now the event is over. No more eggs dropping from the sky, no more boss fight, no more clouds. Though we still have the special stages, but we don't have dragon stage. The code, since maybe people weren't able to get the cookie wheels when the boss fight was out or just didn't see the boss fight, they couldn't have gotten these. But now they have a brand new code called the hatched code. If you redeem the code hat, if you redeem hatched code in the code section, you will get an extra, you will get two more cookie wheels. Look, I now have four of these. And four of these. This is because of the code. This code here that can be used any time gives you an extra two wheels, or if you didn't have wheels, just two cookie wheels. Two cookie wheels is really good for a beginning. And I just like to mess around with most of the wheels. I'm actually going to show you what I do when I'm not recording. And I'm just playing build a boat casually. It's... It's kind of weird. I place down a cookie wheel and a seat. Then I make a box around me. Pretty simple. And then what I have to do is try to survive in this box while the wheel is spinning, not getting launched out of the top. This is not the easiest task. Task. But it's pretty fun for me. Now I just scale these up and make them nice walls. With an empty piece on the top. And then I start spinning and spinning and spinning. And I then delete the seat. That didn't go as planned. But I do want to show you one other thing in this video that's not just the new code. In this video, I'm going to be showing you something different. I'm going to be showing you how to make a basic magnet grinder. Not one of these. One of these. Right here. This is a pretty simple thing. Let me just demonstrate how exactly this works. It's simple. So I'm just going to add a lever. Click and it should start. Now this is kind of like an easier version of Flappy Bird. You just flap on through the stages, flying, and there's no dragon stage now, so you don't have to worry about hitting the castle. The arcade stage is still in the game, just not... It doesn't spawn every time. Now, it probably... You'll probably get sent to the abyss, but, as you can see, I got 100... 35 gold. Pretty good. Now, I'm going to be showing you how to make this. And how to make it is very, very simple. I'll start to show you here. I'll, so, first, place one blue block down. Then, 
place down two strong blocks. I'm using gold. You can use whatever block. Then, you know what? I'll just have a model here to help me as well. So I'll just load back in this. So pretty much what you're going to need is a glue block. So I'm just going to grab one. Then you want to take out some gold and put it and put two gold blocks on that glue on that glue like so then you want to just add then you want to go out so i'm just going to do that you can add this little back piece just to be sure and then you have to go out multiple pieces as you can see four eight nine so we already have, and eh, not the best, but I'll show. But what you actually want to do is kind of like each corner gets one block. So then you have this. So that's two, three, four. Five, six, seven, eight, nine blocks. I'm just gonna stretch these. And like so. Like so. And like so. So once you have this nine by two platform you want to take titanium rods because they are magnetic and you want to just put two of them like you see here one two then you need to take one spring actually i don't think you can buy springs anymore this set i don't think gives you springs do you get springs anymore? Hmm. Yeah, I don't think you can get springs. Hmm. Anyway, you need to face it like this and it will extend outward. Then place another one going up with one block on it. Pretty, and you want it to be pretty heavy, but you want it to be anchored. This should be the only anchored block. Once that's there, you want to take a magnet, which is what makes it a magnet. Oh, grinder. You want to take a magnet, and you want it facing the spring. And it to also be kind of like both poles sort of inside the spring like this. Now, you remember that anchored block? You have to now remove that anchored block. I anchored the spring, or not the spring, but the magnet, why did I do that? Remember not to anchor the spring, like I did. Now, take another block that's not anchored and add it. It should remain like this. Then, you add the last piece, one pilot seat. And once you place this pilot seat, it's operational. 
sit in the chair, then add a lever behind your pilot seat, click it, and it will start moving. Then use W to go up and stay in the air, and then just avoid all the obstacles, and you can easily just glide past. As you see here, I'm just gliding straight past all the stages, but now I want to, oh gosh, make sure not to hit these big rocks because they do so much damage to your boats. Look, my entire golden grinder just got destroyed by them. I'm not going to be showing off how to build these big ones here, the kind of like hovercraft ones, but I am going to be showing you how they work. They pretty much work the same as that grinder, but better. I'm going to turn this one on to get it to normal speed. Now, if you uh, turn all of them on, you'll be in hyper speed. Now, I'm just going to go slowly, but speed up. Now, if you saw my other gold grinding video, where I showed you how to make that flying block there, and I made pretty much like a flying broom out of gold, they patched that. So now you can't make AFK grinders or that other gold grinder I, I showed you. So don't try that one. It won't work now, sadly. It worked in the old update, but if you're in a new and updated server, then it won't work. But there, I got to the end. I got gold block, all that gold. These grinders do work very well. I don't have enough time to show them off, though. But on that note, I think it's time to end the video. But even if you don't have too much gold, you can still get really good, cool grinders like this one here. And one... And even with simple grinders like this, that's just a spring wheel, you can still get to the end pretty easy, easily. This spring wheel here, it is sort of off balance because I forgot a thruster. But it still is getting me far, far into the stages. Even though it's touching the ground and it's not flying with magnets or any too bad glitches. It still got me pretty far. Even though it just fell apart. Um, this is awkward. Um... But yeah, gold grinders do save you lots of time and still give you gold. So, try to find new grinders. Ones that get you to the end, even without complicated mechanics and using magnets and weird glitches. You can still just make a powerful boat, maybe add a motor or a or a jet or a thruster and you will get to the end pretty quickly anyway on that note it's time to end the video make sure to like and subscribe and remember to stay very fresh